and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today I'm going to be going over the presents. Are they worth it? And kind of explaining them. Now, you guys probably have a decent idea of them, but I know plenty of you are wondering, should I spend my hard-earned coins on those presents? Now, I have some mixed opinions on them. At the end of the day, they're just opinions. You guys can still do what you want, and if you guys are millionaires, enjoy the promo. But I also got to help the people that might not know if they want to spend their last their last 30k on going all in for presents. You know, it's kind of a big deal for a lot of people. But guys, before we get into the video, remember it is the 25 days of Pood Miss. As per usual, guys, the giveaways will be kicking up slowly but surely starting today. You guys will know your reward if you win. I decided I don't got to say the reward. You guys are entering anyways, and then when the time comes, I'll say the reward. Because at the end of the day, maybe I'm feeling a little more generous later, and I have to reward by double. Maybe a little bit less. But either way, you guys know the rules. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment down below your console, and the secret word you hear throughout the video. Now... I will be changing it up. I will be saying the secret word in a random spot in the video rather than putting in a separate segment. So it'll just come out out of nowhere mid sentence. So just be ready for that. So let's get into this. First things first, as far as presents go, as you guys know, you get them from the store under, per, yeah, under uh, zero chill. I don't know why I went all the way. So there's a large gift, a medium gift, and a small gift. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys. As of now, I do not like this format of presents any more than last year. Last year was great. Last year was one thing. It was just random gift. You clicked on it. You spent like 240 snowflakes. You got a random gift. It was very simple. And then it was fun because I get a small, a medium, a small, medium, large, large, small, medium, large, large, small, medium, small, medium, small, medium, large. And it was cool because now you got to spend 4,000 straight up. I used to, no joke, I could have spent like 1,000 and gotten a large. Sometimes I'd spend 4,000 for, for one large, but other times I'll spend 4,000 and get like four larges. So it was so worth it because I could get four for the price of like two at the end of the day. So that's how I made a lot of coins. So EA is going really out of their way to make sure that we cannot make any coins off this. Now, when it comes to gifts, right, what can we expect? So I've seen a lot of predictions, I've seen a lot of things, but... Some people were saying like the green could be like a veteran pack or like a team of the week pack. So my concern with a lot of these gifts, will they be packs? Because for them to give them like a monetary value, like this is what they will cost. They're at minimum 4,000. 4,000 makes these presents at least 130K over, depending on what you get these cards for. At least 130K over. So you need 130K worth of value. Now, could it be? Yes, but I don't know. What are the odds that EA gives us all gifts that will make us back our money on large this doesn't make sense not to mention if everyone else spent a certain amount of money on these cards if everyone let's say everyone's everyone could just open this gift right and they all get the gray one i don't even know if the gray one's available but if they all get the gray one that means that when, when they come out everyone's just gonna sell them now obviously if you wait the right you wait to the right time and you could sell for something if it's not a pack to play that's fine but i'm personally not a fan of them giving in an exact values any present i liked it better when it was a random gift because if you look at it, medium gifts are 1290 And the issue with this is that apparently there's only one medium gift and one small gift from what I've heard. Like you can open this 10 times and still get the same gift. So the small and medium gifts are, that's it. That's all they are. Now, I hope that they do incorporate more gifts as well as extra large gifts. I don't know if that's, I don't know if large took place of that now. Not entirely sure. But it definitely sucks that there seems like there's a lot less variety this year than last year. Last year was very like, it used to be, it was exciting. I don't know. I'm so far just not excited about these presents just yet. They're really throwing me off. Now, do I have any presents yet? No. I don't know. I don't really think I could justify spending this amount right here on a present. Like, if you open up... If I want to get every gift, or if I just want to get a few gifts right now. If I open this up four times, that is 16,000 plus kindling. And at this exact moment in time, 16,000 kindling, even with a good value, is still going to cost me like 1.3 million coins, 1.2 million coins. I'm pretty sure. Considering, let's just say this one right here. Like, if I do... I know it's not the best value, but Christian McCaffrey's, they go for 270. He goes for about 7,000. So that's gonna cost, he actually went down a lot. So that's not that's not horrible. So hold up, let me go back, let me backtrack. My initial math I had here on my paper, that's why I read the wrong number. It was going to be, if I wanted if I want to get every gift, that's what it was, if I want to get every gift, I believe there's like eight gifts, seven to eight gifts. Now, if you wanted to get every gift, it's gonna cost you about like, you're going to need like at least 28,000 kindling. Now, the issue with this is that's assuming that you pull the, the ones you need every time. You'll probably pull repeats, but to pull a grand total of seven or eight, it's going to very easily 
cost you over like 1.2 1.3 million coins if you don't pull repeats now the thing is will we get that value back from every gift now these gifts don't seem as rare as they used to be because you can just pull them which is kind of what sucks now i'm hoping they do incorporate extra large gifts at some points but we really don't know so what i'm currently going to be doing i'm going to be getting my free gifts first and work from there because i really i'm not like i really don't want to go all in with my coins like i don't want to spend all my coins in these gifts and then not get a return so i feel like i'd rather just do my holiday puzzle get my free medium gift get some hearth packs get some small gifts save some kindling and then maybe use whatever kindling i get for one large gift and then kind of see what's, what's going on what people think when things coming out and go from there because i don't know about you guys but i'm kind of skeptical of the gifts to be honest right now I, I just don't know like is it feasible to think that ea gave us a gift a gift set right here where every gift profits us now even if they, they they can't really choose if they don't profit us like what if like what if one of the gifts just like a ghost of madden player just like last year the ghost of madden player is gonna gonna, gonna plummet in price they eventually will come back up by that time how late is it i don't exactly know now could one of them be like bo jackson but then again when they give us when they give us that easy of a chance at a present if one of them is bo jackson like it's really i don't know it's a controversy the secret word for today's video is chill comment down below the word chill like the video subscribe comment your console and your um secret word that i just said and you're interested to win good luck that's the thing right now i really don't know how to feel about them a lot of people at first glance weren't even too happy about these to be honest with you because why would they only give us two small one small and one medium that didn't entirely make sense to me now the largest again guys it could be great it could be very great if you already have them i'm not saying get rid of them I'll hold them i don't even know if you can get rid of them i don't know i, I saw a quick sell value on one of the small gifts earlier on a youtube video I'm not entirely sure about that but point is if you have them hold them i have no problem having them and holding them my, my problem is if you only have enough coins to open a present do you want to open a present do you want to save those coins because if not you do you want to be in a madden coin hole in comparison to spending on the present i mean or just saving it in general because we have other things that could be coming such as the blitz i don't really know i hope they do incorporate more extra large presents or more well, extra large in general the whole nother tier because at the moment i don't know if, unless they made large gifts that they're valued higher than they were last year because last year large gifts were just like good unless they made large gifts like the all the end all top gift i don't entirely know and they all open on christmas day which is also quite concerning the market's going to get flooded if these are cards this market's gonna get flooded on christmas day and guys if they're packs if some of these are packs it's not good that's really not that great because that does mean that you're gonna have to actually pull something better than the value spent on it which more than likely isn't gonna happen which is very very concerning you guys all in all pretty much to wrap it all up kind of my overall consensus on what i'm thinking for you guys you guys at the end of the day can always do what you want if you have if you're a millionaire you have tons of coins you just want to enjoy a promo by all means i'm not i don't want to be the promo grinch but i personally am not going all in just yet i'm pumping the brakes a little bit on so i know a little bit more first i want to see these ghost of Madden players they do release today at 10 30 i want to see those first get an idea for are those guys cool am i liking the cards are there some cards like limited cards that i want from this promo first i gotta see that because once i see that maybe like okay fine i'm loving these go i'm loving these ghosts let me go all in i want to see a few things first we have until christmas so remember that you still have about seven days to open them you don't have to rush which is what i recommend i recommend waiting now i have to imagine like ea can't be that bad right like that's my other thing can they really give us present packs that are four thousand or for four thousand kindling and we lose every we lose in all of them i can't imagine they do that either but i also can't i can't imagine they get to decide that could they price fix and do other stuff they might do behind the scenes possibly but it's just it's a it's a tough dynamic i don't know if they're gonna what i would like is they gave us nat cards through them not gonna like not not nat cards limited cards but not ltd cards like cards you can only get from presents so that it at least make it a little bit cooler when you did get them like let's just say right that black one was a Derek carr 95 ghost not saying i want Derek carr but you can only get them through there for the time being that'd be pretty cool that'd be cool i wouldn't like it if they gave me a car that we already have in the game unless it's some ltd car but other than that i wouldn't really like that but i think there has there's potential for these presents my only thing with you guys is just know that i wouldn't kill your bank for them if you have the coins and you already have the presents go for it but i don't think i like me personally i don't know if i want to lose all my coins for the zero chill promo going all into these presents just yet maybe i'll be feeling a little dumb one of these days and i'll go all in for a video that's about it other than that like for my madden player common sense i don't think i can go all in on these i don't think they're worth it just yet until we know hopefully someone gets some clues for us someone has one of those videos where they're photoshopping and they got everything for us and maybe then put a little more faith into it but for the time being guys that is about it is 25 days of poop miss all you just enter is like the video subscribe to the channel comment down below your console and the secret word i want you to do all those things you guys are entered to win 
and I did forget to throw the secret word in, so I'm just gonna toss the clip in again. I forgot to do my new format, but I'll get I'll get used to that as we go on with the day. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out. See you in the next video. Peace.